Those two deer over there being finicky, but this guy right here doesn't really seem to care. Look at that one. There's like deer in this guy's front yard. Look at him. It's crazy how close they're letting us get. That one right there doesn't care about nothing, man. Dude, he, he's, he's like, I'm about there to go join my friends, man. Care to explain what you're doing? I'm trying to put this front facing camera on, but it ain't working out for me right now. I hate these adhesives, man. It takes forever for it to actually stick. Once it sticks, it's like freaking cement. Like, look how hard yours is on here. See how loose that is? It just looks sexy, doesn't it? Doesn't it just look sexy? It's like the icing on the cake. You know what's missing though, dude? She's a little dirty from the other day, but there's something missing right here. It needs to be on here. I Snapchatted a special somebody yesterday to let him know about it. All I mean when you got free time, baby. this morning the last video you've seen we explored one part we're gonna give it a short dangle on a spot we know and then we're gonna give it the hard dangle right, right over there so we're gonna yeah. give it like a half a wang danga and then like a full send wang danga nothing's ever set in stone we kind of decide as we go but that's yeah. the plan that we kind of came up with i mean you know, of course if, like we get over here and we're slaying i don't think yeah, we're just messing them up it's gonna be hard to leave yeah. make sure you like share and subscribe if you like these videos leave, leave a comment. them comments bro yeah. let us know what you think about these videos if you really like them really do hit that like button today there's no clouds in the sky so we pretty much know like 10 o'clock fish are gonna be shut down it's gonna be hot yeah so yeah. i think the early bite will be good yeah man let's do it dude all righty full wing dang dude that's sick dude you caught a bass just playing around before we even got in the water dude i seen one follow this thing all the way in it's not a giant but i really don't want a trouble hook in my hand this morning dude First fish of the day, and we haven't even gotten the kayak yet. Look at that. I'm gonna let him go. Check this thing out. Pretty delicious, right? That was cool, dude. All right, that gives me confidence in this bait. I caught one just throwing off the dock. Oh, dude, I just had a fish. I had one. Oh my God, dude, that was a fish. Yanked my thing all the way across. It was right here next to my kayak. It's probably long gone now. I don't know if you guys can see it as well on this thing, but these fish are going ham on these swim baits today. That's kind of the goal that we have a little bit. It's like a side goal. It's not like an official goal. We're gonna try and catch a couple fish on these swim baits and maybe it'll work out. It's already worked out for Chase so far. He's already caught first fish of the day. And now we gotta see if we can get me on one on one of these swim baits. I wanna catch a swim bait fish. It's been a minute. I've caught a lot of them on those, uh, what do you call those? What do you call those swim baits that we use? Oh my God, I got a fish. No, dude, he got off, no way. No. Oh my God. I almost lost my sunglasses. Yo, I had a fish. Isn't it crazy how like a treble can get tangled and everything, but you can get short struck by fish and like it won't hook them. I say we go hit that point it's back there and hit the good spot. If it's not happening back there, start heading over there. Just to update for you guys too. I'm still fishing this tournament. I got about four days left with the way my work schedule is to try to put fish in. I was in first holding it down for a little bit, but old Trey Beck, that dude catches him. He decided that he was going to go out yesterday and catch old gorilla bass. So props to you, man. But I'm telling you, cuz I'm coming for you. You ain't going, I ain't going down without a fight. Yeah. Yeah. Nah, he just hung up. He's like pulling so many weeds with him, dude. <laughs> I caught that first fish this morning off the dock on that swim bait, but I kind of been going back and forth with the swim bait and the Cinco just to make sure we're not missing anything. Sometimes fish in the summertime don't want to hit something that's moving quick. So I don't want to stick with one bait all day 
and uh, miss out on other fish I could be catching. So that's kind of what we've been doing. So the first fish was on the swim bait. The second one was on the Cinco and he straight up destroyed it. I mean, I didn't even let him have it long. I set the hook quick and he got it in his goal at 11.75. I need 14, 15. So yeah, I'm gonna get him back in the water. Hopefully me and Walker can figure something out. It's been kind of a struggle bus. I mean, we seen him coming up. The sun's already coming up pretty good. We'll let this guy go. See you later, buddy. Thanks for letting me catch you. I love when they do that cinematic stuff instead of just like, you know how most of the time when you let them go, it's like whoosh, into your face? Yeah. So, I don't know. Second fish of the day. I remember a couple years ago, I went to my family reunion and we have a dorm, like a big fat dorm, right? I saw one of my cousins just pull out a toothbrush, put toothpaste on it, not even dip it in the water and just start brushing. That's weird. I was like, there's something wrong with that guy. That is. A character flaw, dude. Oh, got him. Got one? Yep. Heck yeah, dude. Want yes. Swim bait? Yep. Heck yeah. On the swim bait. Dude, did I snag him? Dude, let me see. Dude, you got sunfish. I got a sunfish, dude. <laughs> probably what in the world? Probably got him in the I have a sunfish right now. Look at this. What is this guy thinking? He ended up catching a sunfish on the swim bait. I guess it counts though, right? I'm never opposed to catching stuff like this, y'all. It's like, uh, we don't target it very often, but catching any type of species, whether it's bass or even just this little sunfish right here. I mean, that's kind of cool, man. I like the colors on that thing. It's got like an orange belly and the sides of them is kind of blue. All right, little dude, I'll we'll see you later. I don't know what to say, man. I was kind of speechless. If you saw him, his mouth's like yay big around. There's no way he was about to eat this thing. But hey, he did. It counts. I'm always down to catch other species. I don't know, maybe we can get a couple more on these things, man. It'd be, it'd be pretty cool if we could. fish y'all here we go uh. it's not a bad one got another fish though this one is not on the swim bait though got this one on the rage tail i'm gonna fish the swim bait y'all for real i just there's like a deep hole right here i really wanted to throw it into and caught a fish that's cool though man hey hey oh you got a fish Can put him on the grit I'm just gonna leave him in the water for a second. Y'all just completely missed that, but Chase just had a fish and I decided to throw my fish back in the water with the hook still on it so I could try to get the clip. Oh dang, I'm all up in his way. There it is, y'all. That's a pretty fat fish for it being a peckerhead. Look at the shoulders on this thing. Usually they're like slender. This one is just like straight up arched. The boy's like a humpback whale. y'all so i just i kind of was curious if anybody was tournament fishing today i was really hoping when i looked at this i would see what i just seen right now wes is about to move up the board pretty substantially sucker caught one they didn't put a measurement on it but what i can see on facebook right now he called one of his small ones with a 15 inch and then he called another one it was 16 inches but it was a fatty one bass west you know we love you homie i'm rooting you on right now i hope you catch some more bigger ones today dude because he's already got a donkey so i mean i'm fishing this tournament i really don't care if i win it but it's cool to see how everybody's doing it's cool to see that wes is out there grinding it out right now huge shout out dude got him oh what's he fighting so hard for oh, it's a good one that's why one. that's why it's a good one just pulled in this little largey right here if you didn't notice when I was fighting that fish, I didn't really sound very excited. And it's not that I didn't want to catch the fish. I really did. It's the fact that we've been getting beat down by the sun. It's probably been over two hours since we've caught a fish. This is the first fish we've ended up getting. I'm gonna go ahead and just 
stick it on this scale, man, just to see how long it is. It doesn't matter for me. I'm not doing a tournament. Chase just kind of wanted to see. 17 inches, man. That's a pretty good one. 17 inches. That's not bad. Could be a way worse fish than this. I can tell you this. I didn't think we'd come into this little creek where we're at right now and end up getting one of these little two pounders. Came up and ate it off the top of the water, man. I'm thirsty, the fish aren't biting. I guess today's just not my day, dog. That's a fish. He already dropped it. I don't understand why they pick it up and just drop it. It's not like I'm putting pressure on them or anything. Today's been horrible, dude. We fished all through deep step because it's rained so much that it's straight up brown right now. It's all good, man. I ain't really stressing it. Well, that took long enough. I caught you a delicious bass. I've been fishing hard, so that's Walker. Today has just been, oh my God. Oh my God, oh my God. Do you have a Cinco tied on? There's like a five pounder right there, dude. No, I don't. I just looked over and seen him just sitting there, dude. Just sitting there, pretty as you could please, man. He, Is he, he gone now? Yeah, he's seen us. Anyways, today has not been the day for the Yak Crew, y'all. I mean, we've had days where we struggle, but like today, it's been one of them days. I just picked that one up. I mean, it's not big, but it's another fish caught. We fished hard today. We paddled so far. Definitely been on a struggle bus. They haven't been letting water out. It's low, muddy, but still caught a couple fish. Still tried to give it a wing dang it. We all chase finally just caught his. I actually don't even know if that's his. That might be his third fish of the day, probably. Which is kind of cool, man. We went all the way, all the way back into this little creek that we were in earlier. And it's probably about two miles behind us. It's been about an hour and a half since the fish has been caught. Actually, no, it's been about two hours since the fish has been caught. And now, well, actually, I think I spoke too soon. There's a fish on right now. <laughs> I just got another one. That's kind of funny. I was just talking about when the last time we got a fish is, and then I just whopped this full Wayne Danger right here. Well then, here we go. It's not bad, it's not bad. It's a peckerhead though. But you know what? We just went however long without catching a fish. Chase just pulls one out. And I find it kind of funny how I just pull one out right after him. It's kind of funny how that works like that. The reason why we seem kind of like down and out right now is because it's so hot right now and we've been out here suffering we ain't got nothing to drink or nothing this fish is kind of bleeding but i got the hook out he should be okay see you later bro i think people get the wrong idea sometimes i think they think we come out here and slay fish literally every time we fish it's not the case we have plenty of days where we come out here and struggle just like everybody else you can have the beginning of the day start out good and think you're gonna slay some fish because you caught a couple off a rip and sometimes it don't go that way at all i just find it really odd I got a fish. No, 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 no. Don't do that to me. Dude, it's a big one. It's a big one and I'm caught up here. I need your help. I just need my line undone from that so I can fight him. He's still on right now. I was about to jump in after him. Oh, I got your line. I want you guys to understand, I jumped, I was took my life jacket and the GoPro off because I was about to have to jump in. Walker got wrapped around me. Both of our line got wrapped around a log. He dug in and was stuck. So I was gonna dive down and free him. Look at those sores, dude. It's disgusting, isn't it? He is gonna help. I don't know if they're gonna try to say something about me taking my life jacket off to try to free him, but you gotta do what you gotta do. I got a fish, dude. It's just so funny, man. Oh my goodness. Jesus. That is a small bass, man. Look at that, dude. My new PB, bro. All right, so we are here this morning. The reason I'm telling you this, because I think this is all over the place by this point, you're probably confused. But we were here this morning. The bite was horrible. So we went like two miles that way, caught a couple fish, couldn't get any more. It got too hot. Had it all the way back up here. We were talking about getting out because it's just horrible. It's hot. We're thirsty. All of a sudden they start letting this water out and boom, they turned on like that. That's kind of like a rundown of what's going on right now. I don't know if we're going to catch any more, but we're going to probably try. 
I got no battery left in here, so let's just get right on that. I caught a freaking zombie fish. Maybe I should take, oh, oh, I got a fish on right now. Like we never get bit in this spot and I just missed two feet. Interesting day, dude. Shows how quick the river changes, man. I was like hot, thirsty, ready to get off the water. And now I'm just like, I don't even care. That's a good one. That's a pretty good one. Oh, he threw it, dude. Yo. Get out of there, get out of there, get out of them weeds, boy. Yes, sir. It's a good one, dude. That fish is not gonna help me. It's a good sized bass though, look at that. Chunky thing. Big and sick, dude. Goes to show like how you could be at your wit's end and then all of a sudden they just boom like that. It changes in an instant, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, Got him. Dude. Got him. Got another one, dude. It's not bad. It's crazy, man. They're just kind of like, all of a sudden, they just, they get in that mood. I mean, I'm not complaining though. I'm certainly not complaining. Y'all, this is so wild. This water starts coming out of the dam. They start generating that power. And these fish just, all of these, this thing's feisty. These fish is all of a sudden are just ready to chomp, man. It's kind of wild. I'm gonna let them go though. I'm gonna let them go. I only got like, okay. all right then. Well, see you later, dude. Dude, it turned out to be like crazy really quick. I got one. Be a tank, be a tank, be a tank. I feel like I'm gambling right now, dude. This will help if I can land it. Come on, don't be like that. Dude, this one's got parasites too. Oh. That'll help. I don't know how these fish get those parasites on their side. Normally you catch real clean fish in here, but that fish looks jacked up, dude. We get him in the water. Try to put today in three words, see? I can do that, but they'd probably be bad words. I was thinking the same thing. Never <laughs> mind, scratch that idea. It was really, 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 really bad for the first half. We come back down this way, and they just went on fire, bro. It's hot, we're tired. I'm hot, I'm tired. I'm ready to get me a polar pop from the gas station. Dude, man. I wanna like, I want, it, I want a, like a giant polar pop cup that I can fully submerge myself in yes. and just drink all the soda while I'm swimming around. Yes. Well, hey. Keep the dream alive. Keep the dream alive, man. Go ahead and like. Share. And subscribe to this stuff. This really helps us out. I'm not kidding. I know I say it in every video, but you don't know how much it really does for us when you do that. So if you can really do that for us, I would really appreciate it. And really appreciate That's the it. most important part is the subscribing part. My arm's about to die. So, uh, so let's just, we'll sign off on this one, y'all. We'll see you guys next time, for reals. Peace. Oh, yeah.